This splash screen looks so cool. I am very excited for our invasion of ire. We just discovered where it was because the Overmind scanned Zeratul's brain when Zeratul killed Zaz. So let's get at it. Zerg swarm high orbit over Protoss homeworld of ire. My children. Yes, Papa. I thought Protoss couldn't be infested or something. I thought that's why the hybrid are so fancy. Maybe you need the crystals. Go now, my cerebrate. Secure the crystals and bring swift wrath to all who oppose the swarm. Swift wrath. Let's do it. This is Halo. That's Halo music. I think the Mass Recall people wanted to either make a cutscene for this mission that didn't exist, or just add music, because there was no music. And like, good choice of music. It's great music. I just wasn't expecting it here. <laughs> I think it's Halo 2? And it doesn't really matter. Wait, are we actually going to be just listening to Halo music the whole time? Sick. Okay. Planetary profile ire. Oh, dear. Uh, oceans, jungles, and cities. Uh, moderate greenhouse gas levels and low orbital eccentricity allowed the planet to develop a climate conducive to life. Over the eons, ire's humid rainforests teemed with a variety of species. But by far the planet's most advanced native life forms were the Protoss. Ire has witnessed the ebb and flow of Protoss history, from the psionic race's primitive origins to its accelerated evolution at the hands of the mysterious Zelnaga. Eventually, due to growing antagonism among the Protoss that led to the loss of their primal psychic link, the Zelnaga left Ire. The departure, as the event was later known, caused Protoss society dev to devolve into the most violent civil war ever recorded in galactic history, the a Aeon of Strife. The conflict raged for generations. Zelnaga were gone. Evidence of their presence remained in the form of vast subterranean caverns and monolithic Kaderan crystals, some of which are present to this day. Zelnaga relics played a crucial role in the Protoss' civil war. A mystic by the name of Kaas had unearthed a Kaderan artifact, and though it and through it he re rediscovered the communal psychic bond, psionic bond. That his race had lost prior to the Aeon of Strife. Armed with this knowledge, Kaas revitalized Protoss society through the teaching of the Kala, a new theory that called upon the Protoss to forego their old feuds and reunite. As the Protoss gradually embraced their ancient psychic link, they were flooded with the thoughts, emotions, and experiences felt by members of their entire race, thus tempering the hate they had fueled, that had fueled the Aeon of Strife. In the centuries that followed, a golden age dawned on Ire. Its war-torn continents were healed, its native species flourished, and numerous cities and temples were erected across its surface. I mean, having, like, the deepest level of empathy for every other member of your species would definitely limit Civil War's ability to, well, happen. Bring a drone to the crystal formation. Very, very pretty crystal. Oh, we got hit. Oh, we actually lost a Zergling? Dang. We should probably just hang out. Not scout too much if there's photon cannons just littering the, the area. Okay, we're kind of in a, a ditch area. All right, let's just hang. I'm gonna make another hatchery. I guess I can just make it, like, here. And then our uh, creep spreads further. And it might help with some mineral efficiency stuff. 
Huh. Mutalisk? Ultralisk? Ultralisks are gonna come very late if we ever get to them. I do like Hydralisks a lot. What are you? A Bengalaz. Do you blow up? Do you blow up? Come on. Oh my word. Turns out yes is the answer. This sunken colony is positioned very strangely. I guess it's just to let this spawning pool spawn, but over here would be would be nicer. Let's just drop one there. We have plenty of gas right now, so I don't need to put workers on it at the moment. And now the music is like super quiet. I think there is some, though. Bam. Oh, there we go. So the Halo music was louder because it wasn't just the background music. It was something else, I guess. Environmental sounds. More drones. I don't think we're going to need lurkers. I may end up regretting saying that, but... Alright, let's get a layer started. Let's get our ground carapace. I don't know when we're going to get attacked. Can we make a Hydra at this point? We can. Not a Hydra, but a Hydraless Den. I know I can't make a Hydra list. Go. Wait. I thought there was a wall here. There's a path above the wall. Okay. Goodbye. So I need to make defenses here. There we go. Let's get movement speed first, and then we can get attack range. I'm going to push forward and go kill that proton cannon. Photon cannon. Stupid Star Wars and Star Trek having, like, the same stuff, but with an R instead of an H. Okay, let's let them get to the colony. So now it's just the Hydralisks and this versus Dragoons, which is... Ugh. Kill. Kill them all. Thank you. The amount of economy I lost, or the amount of money I would have had, probably would have counteracted that, but eh, here we are. All right, let's put one there, one there. Just keep making hydralisks. They're very good, and until we see Psy Storms, I'm just very happy to make as many as we can. We can. I was I was going to try and add something after the can there, but I don't need to. Just make as many Hydralisks as we possibly can. I only have 11 people on minerals right now, because I just... I lost some to the combat, and then I also spent four making colonies. So these probably all want to be sunkens. Zerglings are cheap and body block for Hydralisks. That's why you want them in your army. All right, let's, let's go. Do we grab ground carapace next? 
Probably. Oh, hello. Oh, there's a photon cannon over there. Guys, stop it. Why? Why are you up here? Is there another base? Or is this just a little annoying scouting thing? I guess it's just a little annoying scouting thing. Cool. I really like the design of this map. Don't. Our supply is getting near cap, so we should make... What is that? Citadel of a Dune. It looks like a Twilight Citadel. I guess... I guess this is like... I don't know. What does a Citadel of a Dune do? Does it just let you make High Templar? Because in StarCraft II, you make the Twilight Citadel, and then you make the High Templar... The Templar Archives, and then you make the Dark Templar Archives. But I don't know if you can make... I don't know how you make Dark Templar in StarCraft 1. I just said I needed more Overlords, and I just completely forgot. Okay. Let's send some workers this away. All right. Oh, hello. Ah! Ground carapace, yes. Those. More things. Kill this before its unit comes out. Um, there is stuff that way. So this base might need defended from both sides, which isn't great. I need a hive to keep building. We have 16 on these minerals. Let's just send these over here. All right, let's see if we can get to our base from this side. Oh god. Ah, that's bad. Holy shit. Yep, Archons hurt. Archons and Reavers killed my entire base. Okay, well, this is bad. Come back home. Cancel. Just. Uh, that's. That's a shame. I got greedy. I shouldn't have attacked. I should have defended my base while it was getting set up. Okay. I... Yep. Lure everything back to the colonies. Holy crap. I mean... We baited them. Maybe we'll actually be able to do this? Okay. Let them get back to the colony. More workers. Oh, we did it. Oh, we did it. Okay. That, that went great. Make a hatchery. Make an extractor. Make colony. Uh... Quality. Quality. Okay. Yeah, there's gonna be an attack wave here. Don't. You turds. Start building it again. Run, cowards! Oh god, this 
Templar is gonna kill. Whoo, you did it. You died doing it, but you did it. Okay, more workers. Actually, yes, more workers. Do I want more lurkers? Probably. Or any lurkers, I mean, I guess, yeah. Defilers, we just want some base defense right now while we're setting up. So let's grab this angle, I don't know. Yeah, let's get defilers. They make defense so much easier. Come on, start it before the creep moves. Okay, we're good. And then we'll get one, like, right here when the creep comes out. Come on. There you go. Six workers. Okay. Just keep building things. I'm gonna make an ultraless cavern. I don't know how else we defeat Archons cleanly. I guess they're ranged. Defilers are good. You know what? Let's go Defilers. Defilers are fun. They're difficult, but they're fun. How much time's left on... Never mind. Lurkers finished, right as I was saying. I wonder how much time's left. Few more workers, few more overlords. Ugh. I do like hydralisks. So are, you, are these queued? They are, okay. We just don't have the supply for them. That's fun. All right, here's our defiler mound. We want metasynaptic node and consume first. The metasynaptic first, though. It starts with the ability that's most useful. Okay, cool. Focus fire. How much time's left? 43? Ah, uh, these first ones aren't gonna spawn with stuff. I don't think I'm just throwing away my Hydras, no. Okay. Come back here. I'm not gonna make a second evolution chamber. Evolution chamber. Don't know where that voice came from. The first time. The second time was just making fun of the first time. Okay. Okay. Make another one here. This can be a spore. And then we'll get consumed. Now we can get defilers out. And zerglings, sure. Make zerglings. I'm gonna push into this base again and try not to die this time. 
I don't have ultras, but I'm gonna have defilers. Oh, damn. Kill that. Okay, okay. Are they gonna move forward into the range of the defilers? Nope, they're just gonna kill that poor spore colony. How much do they don't spawn with full apparently? What's the upgrade? I'll never know. <laughs> Cause it's gone now. We'll get consumed soon now. Okay. Hydras, Zerglings. All right, let's go. Eat the Zerglings. So there's one. And there's one. I guess we do want overlords in our army, actually. Yeah. All right. We can protect our army from Archons now. Stupid psionic storm. That's so mean. Does it defend ranged attacks? I think it's a spell, so I don't think it would... Hmm, that's not good. My Hydras all died before the thing started. Chill out in the, in the cloud. Oh, dear. It's not melee. Defilers are stupid. What is happening? I don't know what's dealing damage to them right now, but... Archons are silly. All right. Eat the Zerglings. Because the body uh, blocking that they do is useful, but nowhere near as useful as Dark Swarm's damage prevention. I'm not even going to get Plague. Yeah, attack. Freaking Daria. Can't do anything. He didn't even shoot. That's very funny. Okay. We can send down... Wait, this is just a complete wall. Huh. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, let's kill the factory. Because a reaver could pop out and just kill a bunch of zerglings for no good reason. Okay, apparently there's photon cannons on this wall. Which makes sense, it's ire. Like, they've had time to set up. Come on, drone. Ah, oh, you poor thing. I don't know. Ah! Get him! More workers. Holy shit! Get inside and just stay there. Okay. Dark Swarm's absurd. We knew that, but we know it more now. Stop it. One scout is not gonna do anything. Focusing fire on the ones under the Dark Swarm. 
please get the kill. Ah. Okay, we'll, we'll, we'll deal with that later. Okay. I have so much Vespine. I didn't notice that this base was running out of minerals. Okay. That, that, that. I guess the middle ones don't really need to be... ...anything. So this line here is where we can get attacked from. And up here, I guess. I'm gonna drop an overlord. Just up here. Just to watch this. Make sure nothing scary is happening. One zealot. Ah, yay, yay. That overlord did not need to die. So how do I get kills on these photon cannons? There's no ramp. Oh my god. I'm just gonna do like this big, big line. Don't walk through the side storm. Die. You need to die. Can I kill that? No. Okay. Keep the defilers fed. Kill them all. No, 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 no. More dark clouds. Zealots are the only thing that can deal damage through this. I don't know why the Archon is invincible. Oh my god, because I have no Zealots. I'm dumb. Kill the Archon, please. Murder! Okay. Yeah. I forgot how this worked. Again, it's not Blinding Cloud. You, you cast it on your own stuff, and not their stuff. Cool. We're good. We're happy. Everyone's, everyone's happy. We're good. Okay. Overlord. Somewhere. Come up here. This on? No, it's not on last resort. I'll get plague, sure. I don't know. How did a dragoon get over here? I don't know. I think the cheapest way for us to kill those cannons is to just get ventral sacks and then drop just here. Alright. More of these. Keep the creep alive. Let's 
let's have a look over here. If I was a little faster there, that would have saved a lot of Zerglings from dying. Ah! Well, apparently the Zerglings were good enough by themselves. Let's pull back. Overlord, what are you doing? My baby! Okay. I lost a lot of stuff. Okay, what do we do? Ultralisks? Sure. Let's make Ultralisks. They kill stuff. And they're good with Defilers, because they're melee. Marvelous. Marvelous. That's what we were going for. Okay. Let's have a look over this way. Maybe there's a base that, like, loops here. Our forces are under attack. Kill it. Doesn't look... Uh, maybe. Oh. There's a geyser over here. And minerals! Perfect! Okay. I'm just gonna send these guys over here. That's a... S oh, we got two started. We got two started. So we'll have two Ultralisks. This on, is on reserves, yeah. Oh, that's bad! I guess Lurkers here is completely useless. That plague did a lot, though. Wow. It's not the best for shields, but still. Kill. <laughs> Beautiful. This only has 11 workers on it. Let's get six more. Let's get our lurkers. Oh god. I don't have hydras. Good thing I have all these spore colonies, but ugh. Did I do this backwards? Any units from being hit by ranged attacks. Okay, yes, I did that right. Let's get those Ultralisk upgrades started. Movement speed first, probably. So we're good. I'm just gonna throw these guys somewhere else. It's just not helpful having them get me like three Vespin every 10 seconds or whatever when I have empty geysers to still do. All right. Let's grab our Ultralisks, fill up an Overlord, and then just send the Overlord to kill these cannons, because they're being mean. All right, drop. I think that I think they got this. You think? 
I think. Oh god, I put the Archon in it. Run. As long as it's not in it. It's in it! Stop being inside of it! <sighs> okay. Uh, there. And now when this one wears off, it hopefully won't be affecting this guy. Wait. Oh, okay. I was like, did my Ultralisks die to those two cannons? That would be crazy. Okay. More Ultras. More Hydras. Keep killing those turrets. We got 18 workers there. Why is there just an Arbiter here? I don't know. All right, I need my overlord to come pick these friends up. Oh, no, there's stuff over here. No, keep walking. You know what? Bring this guy up here too, sure. Probably unnecessary. Yeah, a little bit unnecessary. Sped it up a bit, I guess. Wow, these overlords took a lot of damage. Or, er, these ultralisks took a lot of damage. That, you're already damaged. I'm not gonna worry about that. Okay. You're emptied. You're emptied. Some Zerglings, Hydras. Get the second upgrade. Get some Overlords, I suppose. That's probably good. Right, three Defilers. Do we have Zerglings right now? No. Okay. We do now. And we will get our Defilers to start eating them. Delicious. Oh, eh, a couple more. Oh, they'll eat if they're full. That's that's a bit of a problem. Okay, I think we're good to push in now. You think? Me? I, I do. Let's go. Defilers are awesome. Oh, crap. We'll clear this out, and then we can go deal with that. I think we're sitting pretty. I hear you. Follow the Ultralisk. Yeah, follow the Ultralisk. Please? Are you actually just not? Okay, well, apparently they're ignoring the Ultralisk. That sucks. Okay. Let's just send the Lurker back. Okay, they're gonna die. Filers are very good, but they're not the most maneuverable. Ugh. Ultralisks are good against Psy Storm. That's... Oh, I just ran my entire army through a Psy Storm. And kind of again. Zergling. Okay. How's our base doing? I don't even think we're going to need to expand to here. We have it as an option. But I think we're doing okay. This is on reserve. I'll send you over here. There's a base here too? I didn't even notice that there was a base here. Th this... 
This place is fruitful when it comes to bases. I said I wasn't going to expand. Apparently, I'm a big liar. Because there's still this huge section, and for all I know, it is actually completely full of Protoss. I don't know that, but I'm a little concerned. We require more minerals. All right, now we just have to guard the bridge. Let's get our colonies set up so that we just have constant extra move speed. Between all of our bases. Just hang out. Wow, we have a lot of ultralists. How much supply do they take? It's four. Oh, they, they don't even cost six supply. Cool. Uh, more hydros, yeah. I don't know when I got nine defilers, but here they are. Yum, 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 yum. Melee attacks two, sure. All right, let's just go. We have our economy set up. It's going. Oh, the crystal's right there. I, I missed that. Like, if you had asked me, I would know that, but it didn't completely cross my mind that there wasn't actually going to be anything more to do in the mission. I didn't need to expand is basically what I'm saying. All right. And then hold off the forces while the drone harvests. Oh. Okay. Sure. Let's do that. So I need, is the drone in it right now? Or do I have to send another drone? Because that one died. I have no idea. I don't see the drone. Hmm. Scout, please. We've got three lurkers on either side. Wait. Oh, one got. One ended up on the other side that I didn't mean to. Okay, the drone is currently harvesting. Cool. I have more than enough economy. I can just make ultralisks for the rest of eternity. Let's just leave these guys here. <laughs> Stop body blocking the defilers. They need to be able to cast their spells. Kill this. Well, this map is mine. Go do the murder. Don't send in this stuff by itself. Fifteen workers, thirteen workers. All forces are under attack. Is it even possible to get up here? It doesn't look like it. It looks like it's a big gate. Sure. Ah, you poor thing. Run! I think we're probably fine. Hold up. I don't understand. 
You'd think it would be done by now. Hmm. Oh, there's a timer up here in the top right that I just could not see. Okay, we're fine then. We are good. I was worried that the pro that the drone died and I had just like locked myself somehow. So is this accessible? It is. Cool. It's not a gate. It's just like a a bridge. I mean, it could be a gate. But it's not like a gate to the outside of the map and this whole section is just inaccessible. Hey there. Just make more ultralisks. They're known to be very good against flying units. Okay. Don't hit my defiler. Or else you're gonna get sick. I didn't even hit my ultralisk there. I was close to, but... Four minutes. Wonder if there's just a you killed everything condition. Because there is that in some StarCraft 2 maps. Doesn't look like it. I mean, there might still be some more stuff over here, but. Ah, my Ultralisks. No. That's a very cool Q setup. Or a rally point. It's just like an array from half the map. Like that. May as well just melt it while we're doing other stuff. Bye, Defiler. Sorry, I need to plague. Wait. Oh no! It didn't matter. Oh, there's no space for it. You got this, Ultralisk. Wait, the plague stopped. I wonder if plague has a maximum amount of damage. It doesn't say it does. Severely damages. Okay. Leaving their health at one. But I guess that's... It has a max damage. It just... If it would kill them, it leaves them at one. Okay. Oh, I guess there's structures up here still. All right, Ultralisks, get in some overlords. If I can see any, there's some. We got five, we got six. Bam. Oh, why do I have a lurker over here? <laughs> I mean, I know why conceptually, but. Goodbye. Oh, I shift. I shifted, but I guess unload isn't an option on on units that have no units in them. Yeah, because it's just load. I'm losing a lot of stuff, but I have like ten grand. <laughs> Well, we'll never know if... Oh! Never mind. Bring the Kadarian Crystal to the monolith. Go get it, buddy. Or the beacon. Kill all Protoss. Yeah, no win condition for that. Go, go, go. I don't even know where the crystal is. Ultralisks are really fast. So I was at exactly 200, but the one in the crystal didn't count. So when it spawned, that's funny. There's the crystal. We did it. 
probably could have done it faster, but I didn't realize that there was going to be waiting after the fact. Better safe than sorry as well. Unless being unsafe means you get to finish the mission in Serenade. ten minutes. The Kateran crystals are in our possession. Yum. Now, all shall tremble before the might of the swarm. Goodbye, Protoss. Shame about your planet. I bet you probably don't want to purify this one the same way you may other Zerg-infested planets. <laughs> All right, that was really long. I'm going to call it here. Have a good rest of your day, and bye. <laughs>